hello everyone welcome back to our channel today in this video tutorial i will show you how to install docker on rhl 9 also known as Red Hat enterprise linux 9. docker is a powerful tool that allows you to package your application with all their dependencies into standard units called containers this makes your application portable and efficient to run across different environments so whether you are a developer system administrator or just someone who wants to explore containerization this video is for you before we begin make sure you have the following things in place a machine running rhl line with internet connection a local user with pseudo privileges for the interest of time i have already prepared a set of commands that i will refer in this video i'll share these commands in the description of the video for your reference so let's jump into the actual step the first step is to remove pod main in the build up this step is optional in case pod main is not installed on your system then you can skip it if it is installed then you have to remove it using dnf remove command copy this command So this command will remove pod main and the build package hit enter specify your local user password the output confirms that the pod main and the builder is not installed on my system so move to the next step adding docker repository on rhl9 system docker package is not available in the default repositories of rhl9 so for its installation we must add its official repository using dnf config manager command so copy this command So this command will add this docker official repository for rhl system hit enter okay next verify whether the docker repository has been added or not for that you can run sudo repo list great so i can see the docker c hyphen stable this is the repo id for my docker repository for my rhl line system after adding docker repository we are good to proceed with the docker installation and this dnf install command so copy the complete command So hit enter this command will install latest version of our community edition version of a docker once the docker is installed verify its version for that run docker hyphen hyphen version so the installed docker version is 27.04 if you are looking for a specific docker version then you can also install that specific version but before that you need to list the docker versions available for that run sudo dnf list docker c hyphen hyphen so duplicates and then pipe symbol shorts hyphen r just copy this command this command will list all the docker versions the second colon is your version string now if you want to install let's say this version for that command would be something like this 
in this command you need to replace this version string with the docker version that you want to install copy this command let's say i want to install this docker version and you need to hit enter so I'm not going with this command as you know I have already installed the latest version of Docker. so I'm canceling this command once the docker and its dependencies are installed then start and enable its service using systemctl commands to start the docker service run sudo systemctl start Docker. Hit enter. Now to enable it across the reboot in place of start, type enable. And the rest of the command will remain the same. And then hit enter. Okay. Now verify the uh, Docker service status for that. Run sudo space systemctl space status space docker wait this output confirms that docker service is up and running next add your local user to the docker group so that your user can run docker commands without sudo let me clear the screen first type sudo user mode small a capital Z followed by the group name so here group name is docker and your username so I am using a user variable it will be replaced with the name of your local user on your system so hit enter next run new grp docker so this command will map the docker group to this uh, local user in my case it is linux techie now type id command and you you should see that linux techie is also added to the docker group great now try to run couple of uh, docker commands without sudo let's say i want to check the status of my docker service again for that what i'll do system ctl status docker or you can also run docker version so this command shows that this is my client version and this is my docker server or we call it docker engine version next step is to test the docker installation in order to test our docker installation we can run a container using a hello world image that run let me create the screen first docker run hello world so this command will fetch the hello world image if it is not available on your local system and then we'll run the container it should show some informational message and post that it will be deleted automatically hit enter as you can see the docker command doesn't find this image locally so it tries to fetch it from dockerhub.io okay this informational message hello from docker the message shows that your installation appears to be working correctly the informational message in the output above confirms that our docker installation is successful that's it for today's video on installing docker on rhl line with docker up and running you are now ready to explore the world of containerized applications Feel free to post your queries and feedback in below comment section. Do not forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel 
for more tech tutorials. Thank you for watching. Bye. Have a nice day.